Hi, my name is John Gibbons and today we're going to look at maximising your gluteus and we did part one which is trying to identify what was misfiring and in part one we looked at the gluteus and the hamstrings and then just to recap, so if you slowly lift your right leg okay, you'll notice that, relax, that the hamstring is very dominant before the glute. There's no point trying to strengthen the glute if the antagonistic muscle of the psoas and erectus femoris is very, very tight. We proved earlier that um, in terms of range of motion and tightness, that the psoas in this case was okay, so we're going to go and try to re-educate the gluteus maximus. Part one, what we're going to try and do is try and disassociate between the left and the right side of the gluteus. So, Angela, if you can slowly squeeze your right bum and relax, and then squeeze your left bum. That's a very simple exercise and it's known as a disassociation. So you're trying to disassociate the left from the right. So we're able to do that. So what we're going to do now is we're going to initiate the contraction on the right gluteus and I'm going to help my patient. I'll show you two ways. So can you squeeze your right bum and lift your leg and relax. Squeeze your bum and lift. Okay, and relax. And we do this a few times. So squeeze, lift. Squeeze, lift. My thumb pressure is firmer, so that means she has to contract a bit more. Okay, so squeeze and lift. Okay, so squeeze before you lift. If you find it, it's very much from the lower back and you put one or two pillows to flatten the lower back. So watch again, squeeze and lift. Squeeze, lift. If it's still very much dominant in the hamstring, we can bend the knee to take hamstrings out a little bit. And okay, and squeeze and lift. Okay, squeeze, lift. And I'm helping a little bit. Squeeze, lift. Squeeze and go. And again, another 10. Squeeze and again. Keep going. And again, and again, okay, another five or so, one, and again, we can bring the leg back, my hand is under, and lift again, last three, and again, last two, and last one. Okay, before we did this exercise, it was very dominant hamstring to the glute, now watch the exercise now, lift, bang, okay, and once more, lift, okay, so we're very dominant in the glute and the hamstring, so now we re-educated the firing pattern.